Baker Bay School District tonight is deciding the fate of a student caught in an OK to say controversy. He reported a potential school threat through the app designed to help kids speak up, but ended up being the one in trouble himself. 7 Action News reporter Brianne Palmarini is live tonight where the meeting's been going on for hours now, Brianne. Yeah, Glenda, to sum this up, there's a lot of frustration inside this hearing tonight. It's been very arduous. It started around 630 this evening and it is still going tonight. Of course, it all stems around the questions here, whether the student knew the other student who was involved in this tip, if the student who reported it knew the student who made the accusation. But see, hanging in the balance here, the student's future at Anchor Bay Schools. There's a lot of people in the crowd at this expulsion hearing with signs of support. And for clarification, we're not showing the student's face. He's not facing a criminal charge. But here is the situation. A student at Anchor Bay High School reported a threat on the OK to Say app. The app is supposed to be anonymous. He said while at lunch, he heard other students talking about shooting up the school. After the investigation, police didn't find enough evidence to prosecute anyone but the school board says it's against their code of conduct to report false threats and punish the student for reporting it. 10 days suspension. Now the school officials believe that the student lied. The student's father say that's not the case. Johnny has a track record of being nothing but truthful, of being a great student, of being nothing but an asset to this community. He has never shown any signs of this at all, never done anything even in the same hemisphere. And I think he was just trying to protect his school and do what he thought was right. Now the student's father is asking for the school board not to expel his son. He's also asking for them to remove this from his record. There's a lot of little in-depth issues about what happened and who said what and when and if this person knew a certain person and there was lots of different incidents and that's all been talked about tonight here, but it will be up to the school board to decide if the student is expelled for making this threat and that's happening inside right now. Of course, we'll bring you the very latest as it becomes available for now. Live tonight, Brianne Pomerini, 7 Action News. Brianne, thank you for the live report.